Hey guys, welcome to the channel. If you haven't been here before, get down there, click subscribe, and join us. Sit back and enjoy the video. First of all, the internet's a crazy place. I found some stuff you can do to your car using household cleaning products. I found you can shine your tires with Pledge. Yeah. The stuff you polish your furniture with, you can shine your tires with. So today we're gonna compare the two, normal tire shine and furniture polish. Furniture shine and your tires to see which one works better. Usually I have a problem with the normal tire shine because you put it on, you go down the road, and you can look at your car, and you can see where your tire has like flicked it all off, up your fenders and whatnot. So that's why I don't usually use tire shine, but a pledge shines my tires without the mess. I'll definitely be using that from now on. This is the other thing that's been a mess. I've got all these keys, and it's really starting to tick me off. I literally only need my car key, the house key, and some other stuff. But I gotta fix this later. Also, check this out. I was going on this bag of beef jerky, right? Pacific Gold, you know, beef jerky. Got it at Costco if you have it around you. It's real good. I went here to grab a piece of beef jerky, and you know, normal piece of beef jerky, you know, yay big. I go in here, I, I wasn't even looking. <laughs> this piece of beef jerky is huge. Look. I've been saving it to eat that, but that's awesome. All right, now, back to the video. First things first, we're gonna need the plunge. Okay, so now here in my garage, with all my books, as you can see, we're now gonna tape off the wheel straight down with this, and we'll be able to test. Black Magic versus Pledge. Instructions for this are uh, spray on and wait one to three minutes, and to make this a fair and even test, we're gonna do the same for the pledge. Okay, so as you can see here, the pledge goes on a more foamy way. Uh, that's how it goes on on your, you know, your furniture rags and whatnot. It'll go on with that foam kind of look. When it cures on the surface, it'll go, it'll go away to a shine. Usually with Pledge, you'll end up rubbing it in and you'll uh, kind of polish your furniture with it. So we'll see, just for a fair test up front, I just you know spray it on and just spray it on. Just as a fair test up front, so we're not doing one thing to one and a different thing to another. But as a fair test, this is just spraying it on to start. Now here's what we're dealing with. On this side, as you can see, it's just kind of dripping off the tire. Obviously it's a little glossy and whatnot, but it's just kind of dripping off the tire. This side, the pledge still hasn't, you know, dried up, and I feel like that's gonna take a while. So this is what you get when following the instructions on the tire shine box, on the tire shine bottle. Spray it on, let it soak, and you know, one to three minutes has passed, and this is the result. Same thing on the pledge side. But what we're gonna do now, get a rag, and we're gonna rub it in on both sides. I'll make sure to use the, um, I'll use a different rag for each. I use a different rag for each substance, and uh, we're gonna rub that shine in and see which side turns out better. As you can see on this side, look, it looks very wet, very greasy, all this stuff all over the tire. It just looks, you know, it just looks wet 
and slimy and greasy and not exactly appealing. And then like I said before, when I usually put this on, it all ends up on my fenders because the tire sits there and just slicks it right off onto the, onto the paint. But look at this pledge. Obviously in here, because I didn't you know, scrub that hard, obviously in here, because the rag couldn't get to it, there's still some pledge in there. But look at the black part of the tire, the walls here. It's very matte, shiny, deep rich black color. But it does not look wet. There we go, look at the difference. Extremely shiny over there, very wet looking. But it looks shined over here, but not wet looking. It looks nice, rich, dark colors, but it's not, doesn't look dripping wet. If dripping wet is what you want, then go for the tire shine. But if you just want a rich color that's not gonna slap stuff all over your paint, go with the Lemon Pledge. I'm gonna do the other tires, then I'm gonna go take this out, outside, and I'll show you what it looks like. Alright everybody, we have driven about five minutes down the road and uh, that's plenty of time for the tire shine to get, you know, get some use on the road, get it thrown around a little bit on the tires. It's about 45, 50 miles an hour all the way here. I just want to show you what each of the substances has done on the tires. As you can see, here's our tape line from before see that on the video I can't really see it on the screen but here's the tape line from before um, the gloss you know that tire shine actually you could see here it's gotten thrown around even more off the tire it's been dripping all that going up the tire very you know very greasy very wet looking shine you know drip marks streaks all over there but the pledge side nice sleek, you know, evenly coated, evenly dry, no runs. It looks, it looks amazing. I'll show you the other tires. I did these other three tires before I left. Deep, dark, rich, black looking tire. You know, black looking tire, nice looking shine. I hope this is, I hope the camera's doing it justice because these look amazing. It's very bright out here and I apologize for the wind. But I want to take you guys out here for a little, you know, a little road trip, showing you how the tire shine and the pledge react on the tires. As you can see, the tire shine it dripped even more when I was driving, and that's how you drive enough miles with tire shine on it. It'll start flapping up all on your car and all the paint because it'll start flicking off the tire. The pledge itself just keeps the tire a rich dark color. There's no drips, no slides, no nothing of it off the tire. It keeps it a rich dark shine. Look at how dark those tires look. They're not. This is how they look before I started, even though it's around the road. You can see, I hope you can see, it's a little dark. But they start all, you know, they start a flat, a very flat, dark. Look about this color, the color of the ground. That's how they started out. Pledge has brought life back to these tires, and I mean life. They look amazing. These tires have 16,000 miles on them, have not been shined since I got the car. And it brought life to these tires. They look amazing. I'm honestly looking at them right now. I'm honestly looking at these right now and I'm like, wow. Those look really, really good. And I'm guessing Pledge is about, I, I haven't bought Pledge in a while. That's just been underneath the cabinet. And I haven't bought Tire Shine in a while because I, I hate using it because it makes a mess. So I'm guessing Pledge, last time at the store, I think I saw three or four bucks for a can. And I'm guessing Tire Shine is at least that, maybe more. So regardless if the price is similar or not, Pledge is the way to go. I'm telling you, these tires look great. There's no dripping, there's no runs, there's no, you know, none of it slapped up on my paint. This tire, I said it both had both of them on it. The Tire Shine side, very sloppy, very drippy. The Pledge side, very clean dark and rich that looks amazing I want you guys to get out there and try this try it yourself let me know how it works in the comments below because for me I'm blown away
and I will always continue to use Pledge on on this car and when I get my truck I will continue to continue to use Pledge because that looks amazing like I said earlier if you haven't been here before get down there click subscribe join us I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day like I said try this out let me know in the comments below how it works for you because it works amazing for me shoot me a like shoot me a comment if you haven't been here before like I said click subscribe and I will see you guys all in the next video peace